Advice for the innocent man shot and killed in his own apartment. Both of Jean's body arrived in Santa Lucia today, where his family laid him to rest. And tonight, we're hearing a new reason why Officer Amber Geiger has not yet been fired. Matt Howerton explains why not everyone agrees with the police chief's latest comments. Dallas Police Chief Renee Hall has more eyes on her than ever before. Her community has begged her to fire Officer Amber Geiger. Geiger remains on paid leave after shooting and killing 26-year-old Botham John in his own apartment. There are things that are in place that we have to do as a agency. On Tuesday, Chief Hall cited local and federal laws as reasons why she can't fire Geiger right away. But News 8 pointed out that DPD's general orders do say that Hall can if the department's integrity is at stake. Late today, Hall sent out a statement that reads less like she can't fire Geiger and more like she won't, saying a DPD administrative investigation and statements given to DPD by Geiger could potentially compromise the criminal investigation. Not true. Current attorney and former cop Pete Schulte isn't connected to this case, but says that would never happen. If Geiger went through an internal investigation for disciplinary reasons, a Supreme Court decision dating back to the 60s says it can't be used against her in a criminal case. There is zero risk for the Internal Affairs Division of the Dallas Police Department to do their side of the investigation, and it's a mistake for Chief Hall to not have that being done. We don't want to be out here protesting, um, but we have to be. The fact Geiger still has a job didn't sit well with nine protesters arrested outside Cowboys Stadium Sunday. If Chief Brown was here, she'd been gone. In their first public statement with attorneys. And we saying we don't want her. And you're telling us we're stuck with her. They want Dallas to remember this is Hall's choice. Matt Howerton, Channel 8 News.